we found, we got the, what is, the young man, why did he go in the water? Why did he do it? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness is right. This was supposed to be a pleasant trip with our friends Ivan and Tammy down the river with our Deanne's Rose in conditions that were remarkable because of high water and it turned into the rescue of a young man. Our local Nottawasaga River had very high spring-like conditions and we managed to get upriver all the way into Jack's Lake from the main end. This gives you some view of our run down when we came across this young fellow. You can just see him on the right. I'll repeat it a couple times as you see him hanging in the tree here. was actually hard to see and we were in a little shock actually to see somebody hanging there so it took us a moment to to react had a hard time finding an opening but here you see this is the best we managed and we just managed to crash <laughs> crash into the uh, branches but uh, this was pretty secure spot actually uh, a little bit uh, rough on the boat but uh, it all worked out you guys are secure It took us a while to find an opening in the riverbank where we could bring in our, our boat. As soon as uh, we managed to find an opening, Ivan took off to give this young fellow a hand. It took a lot of strength to pull the boy up onto the tree as the current was pressing him and basically pinning him into the branches. Ivan uh, was, was able to grab hold of his belt and that's what helped the rescue. I got there in time to help guide the boy to shore, and Ivan uh, certainly deserves a lot of credit for actually being brave enough to drag himself out on a very flimsy tree, as he too could have fallen in and been in quite a bit of danger. Who's back there on a tree? Okay, there was a kid stuck. Uh, with it in the trees there while we were going by and we came back for Ivan and Roy to get him his canoe you can even see his kayak or canoe was under the water he had the paddle on his hand and he's holding on to a tree and they're over there I can't really here they come yay oh okay where's the boy yeah I think they're bringing the boy I think he's going to go for a ride with us there they are. So did he lose his boat? Yeah. Oh, well, boy. But, uh... What? Okay. Her, her, his friend is also out of the boat. Where's his friend? Well, hopefully she's holding on to a kayak. Oh, no! What Here's do you mean? At this point, we were quite worried about his canoeing partner. As it turns out, we were very fortunate that uh, she was picked up by another set of uh, canoeing friends and uh, we saw them further on down the river and hooked up with them there. Um, I'm leaving this as a whole clip uh, until we get there so that you can see how far we actually traveled.
Jeff! Why did he do it? Oh my goodness. Jeff, I thought he just got off. Is he doing? Buddy, the motor. Go to shore, Jeff. Whoever he is, tell him to go to shore. Tell him to go to shore. Go to shore. He can't swim. Go in diagonally. On an angle. Climb up and get up on shore. Oh my goodness. Is Ivan going? Yeah, I'm gonna do a taken. Ivan's gonna try to get the canoe. Tip, 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 tip. So have you guys canoed a lot before? No, first time. First time. Oh my gosh. Ivan's gonna try to get the canoe. Tip, 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 tip. So have you guys canoed a lot before? No, first time. Emily, this area, you wouldn't find any boats like this. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah, first time. Yeah, because boats don't usually come down this way. It's because, yeah, it's because the water is up. That's why we're up here. That's the only reason, but it's very, the current is very dangerous too right now, right? Okay, uh, we had made a mistake actually, or I did. Um, we didn't realize how weak the boy was. We were tied up on a big, thick log, and his legs instantly went wobbly and he fell in. And then there's a language barrier as well, and we weren't we weren't able to communicate. So at any rate, it all turned out fine. Ivan's taking the young fellow down in the canoe, and um, so to make sure that he guides both of them through. And we're going to follow, and again, just make sure they get back uh, safely at the pickup uh, zone. So it all turned out. Fine. Now, just a, an overall comment uh, for inexperienced canoers. Uh, the trees that are overhanging the river are very dangerous. Do not canoe near them. Um, that's typically what will happen. And if we hadn't come along when we did, it doesn't take long for the current to sap a canoe's strength who's pinned up against a tree and end up possibly sucking you under and you'll drown. So please be very cautious. Uh, canoeing seems like just fun. It can be very dangerous. So now we're much more relaxed. Uh, we can enjoy some of the scenery. This is one of the most beautiful parts of our Nottawasaga River. Um, there's lots to see here. If you stick to the end of the video, you'll see a beautiful sand dunes. Um, we're just thrilled that everything turned out well. And uh, the, the canoeists were very grateful and uh, everything turned out well. So uh, we wish them luck in future trips. And uh, now we can just enjoy the trip down. rescued the boy who's with Ivan in that one canoe. He was stuck on a tree and the boat was flipped over the canoe. The girls had the canoe and uh, the one girl 
the one girl was with the boy and she uh, she was she's fine with the other two girls so we're following them right now So that's the end of our rescue. Uh, they're up at the pickup and um, they're safe on land. Um, really have to thank Tammy and Ivan DeRoche. Uh, they definitely played a strong part. Tammy was ready to jump in and, and uh, uh, swim the young fellow back to shore. Uh, but uh, thank goodness she, she didn't have to. And Ivan, of course, uh, who dragged him off the tree. So... Uh, it's good to have qualified friends, and off we go and enjoying the rest of our trip. So we had an enjoyable day with lots of beautiful scenery and good friends and we even had a little bit of excitement um, which we could do without frankly but as it turned out it all worked out and we were quite thrilled and had a lovely day on the Nottawasaga River enjoying our Deanne's Rose. <laughs>